Well, good morning and welcome to uh, Daily Reflections on the 1st of July. And uh, we're coming to the end of our first week on the um, book of 1 Corinthians. And we've actually got to chapter 4. Now in chapter 4, it talks about quite a few things about how we are to witness in the world that we're around. And uh, the first thing is that we are to be responsible and faithful and to be God's stewards. Now, that is quite a place of privilege and uh, and honour and uh, really do believe that if we are, if we follow that just that first point that we will reflect back and think about the actual honor and the place that we're in and and the opportunity that we get through that the second thing is, is we've got to be faithful stewards faithful stewards of everything that he's given us how can we use that to the best of our ability and to um, bring the message of the gospel into our everyday lives into our everyday speaking you know, one of the things I reflect on quite a lot is about actually in our talk, when we're talking to others, do we bring God's uh, view into into being or do we just go along with the world? Well, you know, we've been we've been um, placed in a place where we can be faithful stewards. The next point is, is the judgment of God. And this is about actually thinking about what does God, you know, leave everything to God's judgment in his timing. We have to be patient. Sometimes as human beings we tend to want to be force it and we want to put our opinion on something. But if we haven't checked it out and against the word of God and, and put it in prayer with him and really contemplated on it and thought, well, is this my opinion or is this God's? And just let God, um, you know, the time in to be his appointed time. And that's another key part of this chapter, really. Is, is, is recognizing and doing the practice of the patience in the appointed time don't force it don't try to make it what it isn't just wait on god as we work through that that doesn't mean that uh, it's not going to happen quickly what it means it's going to happen when god uh, puts his wisdom into it and uh, and and we wait for him to bring the thing but the most important part of all of this is that we praise God. We praise him for everything that's happening in our lives and we give him the, the, him the honour and, um, and everything that happens is because we have this relationship with a fantastic almighty God who loves us and is faithful to us in all that we do. So that's my thoughts to uh, sum up the end of this uh, this week's uh, look at First Corinthians. And I'm looking forward to starting next week's uh, where we will probably get to another four chapters done. But until then, uh, I'll see you next. Uh, see you next week.